Yeah, we're pretty pretty seedy when we turned up from our big night partying, but um, once I think we sweated out most of the alcohol on stage. I'm um, feeling pretty good now. It was a good yeah. We had fun up there. All right, I'm I'm Mike. Uh, I'm from California and then and then Australia and then back to California now. Yeah, I'm Adam. Uh, from originally Ballarat, but uh, but lived in Melbourne for a long time now. Yeah, and I'm, I'm Pete, play drums, and same story, from Ballarat, Australia, and live in Melbourne now. Pretty chaotic. <laughs> we, we came in from Albuquerque, uh, which was pretty chilled out, and then straight into downtown, and our heads were kind of spinning off our necks. But, uh, yeah, it's been madness, a um, lot, of, lot of drinking, but... <laughs> generally positive. Yeah, yeah very positive. Um, yeah, it's been, been a pretty crazy time. Well, Mike, yeah, lived in America, in Australia for a long time, but he's he's been in America for about a year now, so we tour once a year, like do a full tour. Yeah. So the accents a bit on stage. <laughs> not really. Mike does. I, I like putting on an Australian <laughs> accent on stage. That's, yeah, it's not, hard to order food. People no one understands us if we put on the accent. So. Yeah, people don't even think it's it's a joke if you put on the accent. They just think you're American. <laughs> no, but I think like um. I mean, I, I think as far as being Australian goes, like that's like the Australian musical heritage is one that's like fairly important to us, and like um, yeah, we, we t- like we take a lot of our roots from you know like for bands like Feed Time and and the Scientists and uh, um, yeah, you know, a lot of that school, kind of like stuff. Aussie stuff, yeah. So, uh, work at a, I work at a bar, <laughs> um, save a lot of cash. Yeah. Save, save fortunate, enough, fortunate enough to have some shows on the tour that help pay for a lot of stuff. Yeah, basically, like that's yeah, we pay for the flight over, the savings, and then like the shows kind of make money from shows. So we've been, we're doing a full tour either side of South by Southwest, so get money to get get around. Yeah, it's yeah, a strong strain dollar at the moment helps too. Yeah, yeah. It makes things a bit easier. <laughs> Yeah, we've seen a lot of uh, stuff. What was that Japanese band called? They were badass. Uh, Gaga Karais, I think. That was probably yeah. our favorite. Yeah, they were great. Man. Crazy yeah, Japanese great two-piece. last night was awesome. Yeah, Puffy Ariola's awesome. bloody excellent. What a name. Yeah. <laughs> great name. Pretty solid. Yeah. Pretty yeah, badass band. Yeah, we've seen a lot of good stuff. Yeah. I figured I figured it'd be like just walk... Basically, I would walk in, I'd be transported to, um, you know, Melbourne instantly. <laughs> G'day, mate. Um, no, I didn't. I mean, I knew that I'd, I'd seen a lot of the lineups of, like, a lot of good bands playing before. But, um, yeah, I didn't realise it'd be quite on this, like, on the, as epic as it's been. Like, a lot of pretty great, like, pretty big turnouts. But, yeah, it's good to see. One people. thing, I, I did expect snags, though. Yeah, yeah I didn't no, get a snag. <laughs> Uh, New Orleans is the next stop. Two or three to south, up to Chicago, Indianapolis, and then head to New York, the East Coast, New York City. Playing a few shows. That band Feed Time we mentioned, about it, Australian band. Um, yeah, that's about it. Yeah, still got a, yeah, we've got a fair bit of a tour lined up still. Yeah, we're only about halfway through. So uh, it's about our fourth time in America. Um, Doing a doing a tour. Um, Pete, yeah, Pete. Pete's been over once before. Yeah, this is my second time. Yeah, on drum. We had a different drummer like the first couple of times. Uh, <laughs> we we've just uh, expanded, obviously expanded the um, the fan base a little bit to people who other, otherwise wouldn't have heard our stuff. You know. Yeah, I think just every time you go around, a few more people hear it and get interested. Yeah, just like touring anywhere, I guess. We got a, a new tape out on Twin Lakes Records. Uh, the Connecticut label, Twin Lakes Records. Yeah, it's called uh, Trouble Coming Down. It's good.